What up guys, Coach Levi here, welcome to Tumble Smart. Uh, I'm here to talk to you guys about hand placement today, your hand position whenever you're tumbling. Uh, specifically on back hand swings, but this also can apply to round up. So a lot of times I'll see kids tumble in their hand position is out like this, forward. You can't get any push, you can't get any block the way that you need to whenever you're doing your back hand spring. And this here is exactly what you don't want to do. Horrible, no power at all. Look at that. Oh man, it just hurts to watch this. So a better hand position to have is your hands straight forward here, but the best hand position whenever you're doing a back hand is for your hands to slightly be turned in here. So where whenever you go, you can get a good push off the mat. You're using your, the uh, most efficient joints and muscles in your body the way that you need to. Okay, now we're talking. Look at that power. Yes, so much better. Another big problem with your hands being out like this if you were to do a back handspring is it exposes your elbows to a position that can cause hyperextension. As a coach, just as a human being in general, I don't want to see someone's elbow bend the wrong way. Hyperextension is something that I never ever want to see, so it's something I'm very, very, very um, hard on my students about not turning their hands out like that. So I'm gonna give you guys some really easy, practical things to do at home so that when you're in the gym, you can actually make that change, all right? So here we have blocking off the wall. If you notice my hand placement, slightly turned in, pushing up out of my wrist whenever I come out of it and pushing through my shoulders. Very, very good drill for blocking. Then we go into hand placement and your arms getting back behind your ears. You clasp your hands together, lift your arms all the way up by your ears. That gives you that good muscle memory. Then we're gonna get into a drill that's going to help you with pushing and blocking up uh, you notice the hand placement here. You want to make sure that that is in the correct spot before doing that. And then our very last one is diamond push-ups. This is another muscle memory and strength exercise to help you push up in the position that you need to. Thank you guys for watching and happy tumbling.